Hello, everyone. This is Julie with you. Today we have a magical and intriguing story that will surely capture your hearts. We're diving into the life of Elizabeth Liz Johnston, star of the reality TV show Seven Little Johnstons, and her journey to motherhood. But there's a surprise. Stay tuned to find out why her story made headlines. Elizabeth Johnston, 22, has become famous as a member of the largest family of little people in the world. She recently welcomed her eight-month-old daughter, Leighton Drew Bolden, and here's the kicker. Leighton is not a little person. Liz and her boyfriend, Bryce Bolden, were very excited despite the baby's height. We would have been happy if she had been short or tall, Liz told Today to Calm. She expressed her relief that Leighton has not had any medical issues so far, calling their daughter a blessing. Liz has achondroplasia, a common form of dwarfism, while Bryce does not. Throughout her pregnancy, Liz was unsure whether her child would inherit her condition. The ultrasound specialist often remarked on how tiny the baby appeared, and Liz's midwife noted that the baby's features mirrored her own. The uncertainty persisted until a detailed ultrasound showed that Leighton could curl up into a ball in the fetal position, something that small humans cannot do. Isn't that incredible? Leighton's birth was featured in the season finale of TLC's Seven Little Johnstons, which aired on July 2nd. Liz recalls the intense emotions associated with her cesarean section, which she had to undergo under general anesthesia. Although she was a nurse familiar with medical procedures, the reality hit her hard as she lay on the table saying a short prayer before being put under anesthesia. When she woke up, she was overwhelmed with joy at seeing her daughter for the first time. She repeatedly asked the doctors if Leighton was okay, haunted by the memory of her brother Jonah Johnston's complications during childbirth. Can you imagine the relief and happiness she felt? Living in Forsyth, Georgia, Liz knew that because of her dwarfism, she would have to travel over an hour to Atlanta to receive medical care. Luckily, she found the same OB, GYN, who delivered her mother's baby when she was pregnant. Talk about a full circle moment. For Liz, preparing for motherhood has been a unique journey. Finding accessible baby products such as the Gertie Crib, designed for parents with disabilities, and car seats and strollers adapted for people with LD, made her life easier. However, it was not easy to cope with the interest of strangers in her child. Liz admits that she switches on her evil mom mode when people try to sneakily take pictures or get too close to her daughter. Now Liz and Bryce live with their parents, work full-time, and are saving money to buy land and build their own house by the end of the year. With the support of both of their families, they are overcoming all the challenges of parenthood, especially during difficult times, such as during Leighton's reflux attack. Despite the challenges, Liz and Bryce are committed to giving Leighton the best life possible. As for expanding the family, Bryce humorously insists that they don't plan to have another child for a long time as they are still recovering from the stress of the cesarean section. What an inspiring journey! Don't forget to like, subscribe, and click on the bell icon to stay up to date with more heartwarming stories and celebrity news. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Julie is out.